A New York-based automotive writer says his visit to Chattanooga stinks. In a recent review for the new Volkswagen Passat, Jamie Kitman writes the stench from the sewer system is overwhelming and tarnishes the scenic city's image. News Channel 9's John Pless went sniffing around downtown today to find out what people think of the unflattering article. John. Well, Latricia, many people we talked to talk with today say yes the smell of sewage can be overwhelming at times the mayor's office says they're disappointed Kitman chose to focus on the smell over the VW plant when New York based writer Jamie Kitten came to Chattanooga to tell the Volkswagen story for automobile magazine his focus changed he discovered a dirty little secret to outsiders our downtown sewer system sometimes belches an obnoxious odor on hot dry days so what do you think when you walk outside and you smell that I be thinking something that died somewhere. That's all I be thinking. Or maybe the sewer, something in the sewer, something that went bad. You know. Well, it's, it's like raw sewage. Mm -hmm. You know, and 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 it's it's a bad smell to leave a. a Quite a smell. You've probably smelled it for two weeks after you leave here. In his article, The Not-So-Sweet Smell of Success, Kitman writes, I was greeted by the most incredible stench. Oh, death, where is thy sting? We know where your stink is. But before you say poo-poo on Kitman, remember, most days there is no stench. But I haven't noticed uh, any odors at all. I haven't been here long enough. The problem is a 100-year-old sewer system that combines stormwater with wastewater. During periods of dry weather, the methane gas can drift out of the manholes. Kitman writes his experience makes recommending the city as a vacation destination or as a place to locate your heavy industry problematic. Aside from the sewer system, there is another assault on the nostrils here on the south side of Chattanooga that people are taking a note of, and that's the chicken plant right here at the corner of Broad and Main Street. Yeah, but mostly my big issue is the chicken plant smell. <laughs> <laughs> just actually just walked from the south side and it's pretty strong down there today. Too bad Kitman came on a bad day weather and smell wise. Most cities smell have something you know what I mean I figure Chattanooga has lots of other things to offer I mean at least we're we're a pretty city so it's well, fixing the problem will cost $400 million, which the city just doesn't have. But city spokesman Richard Beeland says the problem is being addressed one small step at a time when money is available. Patricia. All right, John, thanks for that story. Well, from a bad smell.